year plus against Lucas's changeup. That's a changeup, and it's speared by Abreu. It's a double play. That's when a base runner is hung out to Dre because you can do nothing about that. Dylan Stuff is the equal of those guys. 0 oh, 2 change flutters in for strike three in the first punch out for Gio in this ball game. Two strikes for Jones. There's a heater, got the corner, strike three. They were all. Back to the mound, Giolito looks to third and then flares it on to first. Hedges does not advance Miller, and there's one away. Which, if he stays there, is not a bad thing. Center field. There is that fly ball you were talking about. Robert throws it in. Miller's on his way to third, and he is in there safely. He anchors himself. And two away for Stephen Kwan with a runner at third via strike. And that was that was a pretty good one. That was subtle. In the air, middle infield. Harrison's back on it, and he makes the catch. That will do it. Sure. All right. Three and two. It's a changeup dusted to right field down the line, and A.J. Pollock runs it down. That's an exceptional catch by the Sox right fielder. What a run on that ball by 18. There's a scoring position. There goes the bat. And there goes the batter as well. Hope everybody's okay in the dugout. Yeah, the net's not going to really help you on something that sails over the rail. I think everybody's going to be okay. <laughs> Liam. 3 1. It's a changeup in that jammed him. Sebi Zavala reaches out and hauls it in. What wow. a play that was. Man. The boys put a little defense on him that inning, and Lucas holds him right there. Slider for strike three, and that was real quick for Lucas Giolito. Ten pitch inning for Lucas. Three and two is low, ball four. Sox walk presented by Feldco. First walk of the ball game for the Sox. Or anybody. To third and pass Ramirez. Oh and two from Hentges. In the air, well hit to right field. Jones is back at the track and it rings off the wall. Here comes Moncada. No throw to the plate. The Sox have taken the first lead on an Abreu RBI double on 0 and 2. There was early in the second game of that double header. And the reason that comes up is Pollock hits this ball on the ground. Uh, Vaughn does, I should say, and that'll get a run home for the Sox. It's an RBI ground out for Andrew Vaughn. And Robert scores Abreu to third and A.J. Pollock coming up. 0 oh, 2 fastball froze Quan one down. Wisconsin. I don't know one up the middle towards second base. Harrison stops the back throws to first double play. Well I think he got it by a half step and they're going to look at it in the Cleveland dugout. This is a great effort once again by Harrison who's had a wonderful run defensively over the last week and a half certainly. And we'll take another look. It's real close. I mean. They're going to take a look at it for sure. Josh did the only thing he could do. It looked to me like he caught the front of the bag before the throw got there. I think the innings going to stay alive but. We shall see. This looks a little bit like an overturn. Yep. The crowd's cheering. By the way, right leg tightness for Aloy Jimenez is the injury update. After review, the call is overturned. The runner is safe. Cleveland retains their count. 
So it's Reyes to third, Miller to first. Two down. To second, Harrison on the short hop makes the catch, and the inning is over, and the lead is intact at two to one. Second in baseball, and he had one in his last plate appearance. He's got one here. Graveman paints him on the inside corner. This is the start of the 12 and a half. Yeah, he's, he's not going to strike out another 30 at bats, but the side. Wave and a miss on a slider. What a pitch for Kendall Graveman. Two. One and two. Ramirez center field. Roberts underneath. And that's a one, two, three, eighth inning against the top six games in a row. Naylor in the air to left. A.J. Pollock, huge first out. One, two. Struck him out on a fastball. Well, I love the location behind fastball by him or throw a slider down and in. Slider got him. Graveman and Hendricks six up, six down in the eighth and ninth. And the Sox have battled back to split this series in Cleveland two to one in a game that's been on the edge all night long.